am Dr. Kimberly with Holistic Healthcare Centers, and today I'm going to tell you a little bit about water and the rocks and how that relates to yin and yang energy. All right, so I am in Hawaii on the big island, which is amazing. And I was really drawn to make a video about the elements. So clearly the water is very yin. See that beautiful water. But the waves are yang. And so what that means is the yin water is water, is calm, is smooth, is nourishing, is, is flowing, kind of like our bodies have blood. That's considered very yin. But the movement of the water is very yang. It's forceful. It's pushing, that's kind of like the cardiovascular system, pushing the blood through our system. And these rocks, which are amazing, are cooled lava rocks. So lava is basically the epitome of yang, of fire, of heat, of movement. But now that these rocks have cooled, they have turned into pure yang. And what's neat about that is it's an example of how yin and yang works. With the yin-yang symbol, yin goes into yang and yang goes into yin and you have the dots of yin and the dots of yang in each. So these lava rocks, in my opinion, are a great example of how yang has turned into yin. And the water is an example of how something can be very yin, but the movement of it and the force of it is completely yang. So let's get a little bit of this water here. Here we go. So here is a beautiful Hawaiian example of yin turning into yang and yang turning into yin. <laughs> 